Hey everybody, today we're gonna learn how to change tire because I was driving down the road and boom, my tire went out on me. It is flat as a pancake. First thing I did was I got my uh, lug wrench and uh, realized that my the one I had in my car was actually too small. This is the one that came with my car. It's too small for the lug nuts. So that was a problem. So I had to go out and get another one. So before you start out on the road, make sure you check your jack and your lug nut wrench and see if they actually fit your car. It's a good thing to do in case you're out on the road like I am and break down. So we're still gonna be able to use this to put the jack underneath our car. First thing I usually do is I get my lug, my lug wrench out and I loosen my lugs and make sure that before I lift the car up, my lugs whew, can turn. And that way, when you get your wheel up, you'll be able to get your wheel off quicker without having it to spin or get it up in the air and realize, oh, I can't get my wheel off because my lug nuts won't turn. So while it's down on the ground and you have some friction to hold it, loosen your lug nuts. Oh, whew. man, good thing I work out. <laughs> Since those are loose now, we're gonna get our jack and we're gonna position it underneath our car. Our car actually has a cutout right here. As you can see, it's a Dodge Charger. It has a cutout that I'll put this notch right in there onto the frame. And that will help lift the car up. Now, of course, when you're doing this, since I had a blowout and I was driving the car, I did ride on my rim a little bit in order for me to find a flat surface and a safe place off the main road. So you might want to try to do that, especially if you're on a highway or a very busy road. You still can limp your car at a decent speed off to the side of the road so you don't get injured while you're trying to change your tire. All right, let's get this bad boy up in the air so I can change my wheel. We're up high enough now that there's some clearance between, obviously, our wheel and the floor. So once we get this off, we will get our spare out of the trunk and we will put that on and if we don't have enough clearance, we'll go up a little bit higher to get the spare on. And it's one of those little tiny 50 mile an hour spares, but it'll be good enough to limp me down to service station so I can get a new tire put on. Oh yeah, I'm a pro. <laughs> don't use that. All right, we're gonna lift this on here and put it on. There we So we put her down. And you want to do this slowly. You don't want to do it too fast because your car will fall.
All right, well, now that we have our wheel on, we're just gonna tighten those up a little bit, make sure they're on good. We'll put all our stuff back in the trunk and we'll get to the mechanic. So that's how you change a tire when you have a flat on the road. I hope it helps you. If you like this video, please click like and subscribe to our videos so we can show you how to do other fixes to your car. Thanks for watching.